Hey growers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Idalia and today we're talking about garlic. Today I'm going to be harvesting some garlic. If you're new here, consider subscribing and give me a thumbs up. All right. Okay, so this is my garlic here. I planted this garlic in October of 21. I have two elephant garlics, which is this one and this one. And then, oh, I think I have four. One there, one here, here, and then up in the front. And the rest of these are just regular, small, normal garlics. Um, I purchased these from the grocery store, the just a normal set of garlic, and I put them in the refrigerator for about four to six weeks. Um, yeah, about four to six weeks, I put them in the refrigerator, and then after that, I just immediately planted them out to simulate a winter, you know, for them, because it doesn't get too cold out here in uh, California, so... Anyway, let's get started. So this is the elephant gar garlic. Um, the foliage is died back a lot. These grew the scapes and I cut these off here. Um, and I ate those and those were delicious. Um, and I did harvest one gar normal sized garlic. Uh, I did harvest one garlic from here and it was quite small. The one that I harvested, it was probably this size. So I gave it um, maybe like two more weeks. Hopefully these have bulked up in size. So let's start. I don't want to, ooh, I feel it too. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay, okay. I'm happy with that. That's one, I put it here. That's what we got. That is the elephant garlic. I don't want to pull it. Oh, this is deep down in there. Oh, I didn't grow too. Oh, yeah, I did. I did it. Mmm. Nice size. Not too big, though. Does it have any? Anything else down here? Oh wait, I got potatoes in here. <laughs> this used to be my potato um, thing. Actually, after I after I finish harvesting this garlic, I must plant some potatoes in here. After I pull all this garlic up, I'm gonna plant potatoes. So there we go. Oh, this one's bigger. Yeah, and there's a little, well, I'm going to leave these back in there so they can regrow. There's one here too. Okay, so these are elephant garlic. And what else we got? I'm going to try to pull it. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one's a smaller size. Smaller size, but decent. Let's see what else. There's a lot of them in here. I'm just going to pull them. So yeah, this is my first time growing garlic and I just, I wasn't sure last time I did it, I didn't put it in the refrigerator to um, go through its fake winter and it didn't do anything. It didn't grow hard, nothing at all. It was just a waste of time. So this is my first year and I seem to have getting something done. The one that I picked two weeks ago when I pulled it out, the little garlic cloves were purple. And now I insert a picture of that. So I didn't know if that was, the one that I bought wasn't purple. Oh, this is heavy. Oh man, this is a big King Daddy right here. 
Oh yeah, this got some, some nice little size on it. My gosh. Compared to the other ones, look how big that is. And it has a few ones on there. Very good, very good. Happy with that. Uh, so looking at the size of these garlics, I'm definitely gonna grow them again. It takes a long time to grow them, but um, I think it's worth it. Grow your own and then you know that nothing, no pesticides or anything is, anything harmful to your body is in here. This is a nice size garlic. Actually, this is the size, did you see it? Oh, this is the other elephant ear. I mean, uh, elephant garlic. Okay. Last one. Oh no, there's two more. It's a baby. They got a hell of a root system though. That's for sure. Oh, it's two more. One and two. Very good. My goodness. Let's lay all this out and see what we got. And this dirt is really nice and loose too. Nice and crumbly. I'm gonna leave all this uh, shavings and dead leaves. I'm gonna leave it right up in here. But I'm very impressed on how the dirt's nice and loose. So I'm gonna plant some potatoes in here. Reuse this dirt. Oh, look, some potatoes in here now. I gotta go through this uh, container though because when I had. Um, looked in here the last time I saw some grubs oh man there's a lot of potatoes my goodness let me pull these things out so we gotta harvest the potatoes and harvest the garlic I thought it was only two but I thought some more got this dirt out and go through it make sure ain't no grubs up in here oh here's some more potatoes Oh my gosh. I'm gonna do something with these potatoes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take everything out though. And uh, make sure there ain't no grubs in here. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Oh look. This, this one uh, didn't do much. Yeah, I'm gonna make sure there ain't no grubs. Lord Jesus. Girl, girls grow potato and uh oh my god, look at this. <laughs> ah, friendly surprise. You think you grow in one thing. <sighs> you got two whole crops going on. Actually that's not a bad idea. I might grow try to grow some potatoes in here at the same time. Hey honey. Oh it's my husband everybody with his do-rag on. To come grow do rags out of loofa leaves. Oh. <laughs> he doesn't garden. He likes to make fun of me. Anyway, back to the show. Anyway, so I think um, I'm gonna dump on all this dirt. Oh my gosh, more potatoes. Oh Jesus. But this, this soil is so loose, nice and fluffy. Very good. Okay, let's see what we got. Alright. So I'm going to show you all the garlic. All the garlic. This is my daughter. So, yeah. And so these are all the garlics that we've grown. Including? These are elephant garlics. These elephant garlics. So we got a lot going on here. <laughs> um, there are about 21 of them. Probably the way you can tell is because these are bigger. Yeah, the elephant garlic is definitely bigger. And they have a lot of these little baby bulbs on them. Um, these, if you plant them back in the soil for a whole nother year, they'll grow and make one giant size elephant bulb. Um, and if you plant them for two years, they'll produce another whole, the entire plant. one. Yeah, an entire elephant. So it takes two years for one of these to become one of these. 
And when I'm pointing at this, I mean this teeny tiny. This it looks uh, like a mole or something. Yeah, this um, this guy. After two years, it'll turn into this guy. So, and I see one <laughs> under there. There's a few of them, so I'm gonna keep them in the dirt. I have no problem waiting two years. It's probably like another whole scene. Now, this one right here is probably bigger than the one that I got from the store. This thing is humongous. So now, so now that we have all the, the garlic harvested, I'm gonna, I brushed them off the dirt. I brushed off the dirt as much as possible <laughs> with just a regular brush. And I'm gonna let them air dry um, on a rack or something for, I don't know, a week or two or whenever <laughs> I see the skin start to harden up, crisp up, because right now it's really moist. I can feel the moistness in the, I can feel the moistness. After that, I'm gonna store them and start eating them. I might start. We to eat garlic. We might start, well, I'm gonna start eating some tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you give us a thumbs up, like and subscribe, and share with other friends. And when you click the notification bell, you'll get alert every time so you can watch a new video. Bye. Bye.